Over the next two days, you are gonna be creating a drawing for me so I can get to know you as an artist. And our drawing is going to focus on the theme identity. To capture this theme, I want you to draw from one of the following prompts. How others see me, who am I, my greatest joy, when I'm alone, my biggest dream, someday I will, my journey, my biggest fear, when I was younger, or when I grow up. I'm choosing to do my biggest fear for my sketch. So what is my biggest fear? It's actually failing. Failing is pretty broad though. So what do I actually fear about failing? Well, first, I fear failing in my role as a mom, a wife, and a teacher. But moreover, I fear in those roles, I will fail being loving, kind, patient, and even forgiving. Now that I figured out what I fear, I have to think. I have to think about how can I actually show this fear of failure as a drawing? For most drawings, the thinking stage can be the longest part of the drawing process. Figuring out how to take those big ideas and transform them into visual imagery that can communicate your intent is sometimes the hardest part. After taking time to think about how I can show this fear of failure in my roles as a mom, wife, and teacher, I decided a girl on a boat fishing with fish swimming below would be a great representation to show my main idea. The fish would represent the roles and characteristics I fear failing in. The woman fishing represents my desire to catch, or in other words, own those roles well. See, when you're fishing, you have to be present so you can be ready to catch in real and a fish. This mirrors what I need to do in my roles. If I want to be good at any of the things I fear failing in, I have to be present so I can make wiser choices in the roles I've been gifted. After brainstorming how you plan to draw your chosen prompt, you have to think about what materials you're going to use to create your drawing. These can be any materials you have around your house. I'm going to be using probably some markers, pencils, paper, and glue because I'm going to be making a sort of collage. Next, you'll need to make a thumbnail sketch of your drawing. A thumbnail sketch is just a small drawing around the size of your thumb that shows a smaller proportion size of what the final drawing will be. Then, after you've drawn the size, sketch the placement of all the things you want to include in your drawing that will help communicate your drawing's intent. I am applying the rule of thirds, and I am going to be placing the woman, who represents me, fishing on the boat in that upper left-hand side of my rule of thirds connecting point. I am then going to be placing the fish as cut out pieces of paper in the area below. Inside the fish, I will be writing the rules and characteristics I fear failing in, like the mom, I fear failing as a wife, a teacher, and then also in those characteristics of patience, kindness, loving, and then being forgiving. Today on Schoology, you are going to find the set of directions that goes over everything that I just talked about. You're going to have to first choose the identity drawing prompt that is most interesting to you. Then you're going to have to brainstorm ideas. What do you want to say and communicate about your chosen prompt? Please write your response in the space provided below. Then you have to communicate your ideas. So how can you visually communicate them? In other words, what are you going to draw that will explain to the viewer what you want to say? Write your response in the space provided below as well. Then I want you to think about what materials will you use to make your drawing. Use whatever you have laying around your house and then write that response below. And then finally, I would like you guys to make a small thumbnail sketch that captures what you want to draw and where you plan on drawing it within the proportion of your final sketch size. Please take a picture of that thumbnail sketch and paste it below the area. Once you've completed filling out steps one through five, you can submit this into Schoology in the assignment for today. If you want, you can begin making your sketch or you can save it for tomorrow's class period. You should spend about 45 minutes to an hour actually sketching this out, and then when you're done, take a picture of it and submit it into tomorrow's assignment. Be ready to talk about this drawing when you come to class in two days. I look forward to seeing everything that you guys make, and if you have any questions, let me know.